The Words of This Life with Apostle Grace Lubega. Not everything you see and hear is true. Do you know that you wound a brother when you gossip or slander about them? The Bible says that, and this is the teaching, the words of a tell are as wounds and they go in the innermost parts of the belly. When I speak about you, I am hurting you and I'm also hurting the person I'm speaking to. The Bible says, moreover, if thy brother shall trespass against thee, go and tell him his faults between thee and him alone and if he shall hear thee thou shalt gain thine brother that he will not hear thee then take thee one or two more if they fail you can come and talk to the pastors and say i brought this second person this third person and now let us talk about it and see whether this is true or not the testimony of two or three witnesses it's established that's the doctrine of jesus christ anything contrary to that doctrine is wickedness Wickedness thrives most through gossip and slander because it looks for the simple. By the time gossip finds you, you must be simple. You shouldn't sit in simplicity. Avoid them that bring divisions among you. Have nothing to do with the wicked man. For the Bible says you shall fall with him. Colossians 2.18 Let no man beguile you of your reward. Somebody can take your reward spiritually before God. Somebody can frustrate your destiny because of cheap talk. Your destiny can be affected because of joining another Christian to fight another Christian. That's why in Psalms he speaks of a man who sitteth not in the seat of scorners. He says, Blessed is that man that walketh not in the counsel of the ungodly, nor standeth in the way of sinners, nor sitteth in the seat of the scornful. Don't sit in the seat of scornful men. Don't stand in the way of sinners. Do not hang with ungodly men. You will destroy yourself. And for more of this, join us every Thursday at Umalugogo from 5 p.m. to 9 p.m. Finero, make manifest.